friends, you know that I've quit doing a lot of Mandela effects because I know long there's so many that I'm asking the why, you know, not just the what's happening. And so there's a who, what, when, where, and why. You remember, and we're trying to decode to get the 100% truth on the why and also uh, the who. We kind of got a little bit of who. It's the, uh, the, uh, the ones above, the controllers and possibly the creators and a creator in God. But uh, anyway, and so, but here's the thing is that they destroyed another good song. Now, I think this one's recent, but let me know in the comments if you saw this one change more recently because I think I listened to the song. It wasn't, my goodness, probably a week ago. So, because we had the question, are there still some Mandela effects occurring that we just were picking up and discovering these now? And, but now we're, I think there's still some lingering Mandela effects occurring each day because this song, Dream On by Aerosmith, I remember listening to it last week. And, you know, because I, I like the song very well, right? And what's interesting about this is it's changing. They're running another good song. I mean, how many songs are going to be run? Ah, I'm telling you, it's, it's disgusting. I hate it, you know. But, you know, it's part of the communication, I guess. I mean, you kidding me? But anyway, so here's, here's what it is. The entire song, uh, Aerosmith, Dream On, I checked every word. Every time that I look in the mirror, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, you know nobody knows where it comes from. But here's right there, right here. See it? Let me draw a little thing for us. Right there. Sing with me. It used to be, sing for the women, sing for the year, sing for the laughter, sing for the tear right there sing with me what the that doesn't even make sense you know i was talking to brother Roy about it the race said sing for the women you know that was i mean that was class lewis said because we used to think it made sense because you know being a uh heavy meddler rock star that sing for the women you know and because that's what they're all about you know singing for the women all this other things but sing with me are you kidding me now, so I'll, I'll repeat it again. Sing with me. Sing for the year. Sing, no, it doesn't even make sense. Sing for the women. Sing for the year. Sing for the laughter. Sing for the tear. Cersei. Sing for the women. Not sing with me. And it goes on and on. Repeats. Blah blah blah. So anyway, I'm gonna stop this because you need to. We don't need to to drive the nail into another truth here. And uh, so anyway, so there's two things that we know. A song's been changed. And that's one. Number two, that it uh, there's still seem to see we're still seeing some Mandela effects come through the songs. Unless let you let me know if you saw it differently, because in my timeline reality, it just happened uh, today. That gnosis, and I had this I had this in my playlist, and I listened to it, uh, you know, at least once a week, and I just listened to it last week. I'm disappointed. Oh, by the way, though. There are some communications, I believe, of this. Now, they always sometimes are very, they uh, have religious connotations to them, right? Like here, uh, I know it's everybody's sin. You got to lose to know how to win, you know. There and you know, there's always something, you know, or some kind of kind. Not always. Uh, maybe tomorrow the good Lord will take you away. See stuff like that. Sing with me, you know. I mean, that's. You know, I always have Lord, like, you know, um, even the song with uh, uh, Phil uh, Collins with, uh, uh, you know, the song where it talks about um, the drowning. I, I heard you, uh, I, but I would not lend a hand. Good Lord, a good Lord. You remember that one? Anyway, kind of screwed that one up. <laughs> anyway, and just too tired. All right. Anyway, I'll cut this off. Anyway, thank you so much for listening and take care, my friend.